Hello Libra and welcome to your weekly energies reading. This is for the week of July 19th through 25th, 2021. We have a lot going on this week. The sun is moving into Leo. We have the full moon in Aquarius and Venus is moving into Virgo. So a big energy shift for everybody this week. We're going to start with your general energies and then we'll do a secondary reading to look at your love energies. So let's roll the astro dice and see the biggest influence that is taking place for you this week in your life. The strongest energy. Ooh. We have um, Uranus coming through for you guys. So this is a week of the unexpected um, surprises, things kind of shifting on a dime, things happening like magic, miracles, unexpected, right place at the right time type of energy um, coming through. So that is really positive for you guys, Libra. I'm excited to see that. Let's dig in further and see what this magic is all about for you guys. Oh, Libra, look at you. This is your overall energy for the week is the lovers. That is a very happy Libra right there. That is, um, you know, good solid relationships, friendships, family ships, romance, co-workers, okay? You feeling in the vibes with everybody, you feeling loved, you feeling supported, you feeling like people have your back, you feeling like the universe loves you because of this magic. So how spectacular the opening cards. Oh my gosh, Libra, let's go deeper. Let's go deeper. What is all this beautiful magic for Libra? Lots of blessings on um, relationship, blessings on things of the heart this week for you guys. Okay, we've got rescue. And magic stream. Oh my gosh. Yes, Libra, this is like you getting what you need exactly when you need it this week, okay? Um, at the perfect time. And this, the magic stream, that's how everything is connected. Signs, synchronicity, that magic that only the universe can bring about for us where it's just, everything is so perfect or there's so much synchronicity that you are left in awe, Libra. And maybe even some of you, like had some um, dream about this, like some foretelling dream, or you've been having some sort of intuitive promptings, like this magic is about to unfold for you, and then boom, here it is, and that's why it feels so damn magical. Um, what you need help with the most, boom, it's coming in. Uh, it, like I said, I just keep feeling like right place at the right time. Everything just boom, 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 like magic. Um, falling into place for you so unexpectedly it just takes your breath away Libra and with that magic stream that's truly where you are feeling your connection to all that is to people to animals to um, you know every single detail of life it, it's uh, like you're blown away um, this and no, I'm not going to use that example. That would not be a good example for this. Um, oh, gosh. It's just everything is going your way. Like you, even, okay, like even if, let's just say, um, you you left your coffee maker on at home and like midway through the day you realize this and you're like, oh my God, I got to, oh my God, I left my coffee maker on at home. It's like there's something that, 
plays out where somebody already comes home before you and shuts it off like you can't make a mistake like in the workplace if you um, overlooked something or were about to make a major error it's like somebody behind you catches it and sees it and has your back instead of being like oh my gosh you screwed up oh my gosh it's like let me fix this let me help Libra out let me throw Libra a lifeline here like that's the energy that's at your back this week from people from the universe and it's like you you get everything right in the moment when you need it and it feels magical and it takes your breath away Libra oh my gosh I'm so excited for you guys let's pull some uh, tarot to look at um, more specific details day by day this week Monday, Tuesday, we have the Page of Wands with the Knight of Swords. Wednesday, Thursday, Knight of Cups with the Devil. Look at all these people coming in. Friday, Saturday, Temperance. You got the Devil and the Angel here with the Sun. And Sunday, Two of Wands with the eight of cups look at you having such a good week you feel so prepared refreshed and ready to move in to the new week ahead of you by sunday oh my gosh libra um you got so many uh, core cards and major arcana going on here so here it is like people having your back um doing things for you behind the scenes um, making your life easier okay and again like if you made like some mistake or error and somebody behind you catches that they're not going to um like tell the manager or tell your boss or try to sabotage you in any capacity if anything they try to hide it they try to cover it up they try to have your back okay it's like this is the week of amazing karma this is the week where a lot of energetic favors are being pulled in by you and um, also I do see where uh, you know somebody may be apologizing to you this week around Wednesday Thursday Libra um, for just you know things of the past something they said something they did or just a really crappy mood that they've been in um, maybe trying to push you too hard or just whatever it was about their energy like by Wednesday Thursday they're saying to you hey Libra I'm so sorry please forgive me it's not your fault it's all me you didn't deserve that they really want to um, mend and then Friday Saturday um, it's just like life feels good for you. You feel happy. You feel blessed. Monday, Tuesday, it's all about social interaction, people giving you messages, people coming in to help you out, people saying positive things for you um, and to you, apologies, accountability, responsibility coming in. This could also be Wednesday, Thursday, um, where this doesn't apply to all of you, but some of you, it's like you made this mistake, you made this error, they caught it they fixed it they let you know and you're like oh my gosh you saved my ass thank you so much and they're like i got you libra i got you and it's because you deserve this good energy you deserve this positive return and then you know by sunday you feel good you are walking away from you know any worries concerns fears you had coming into this week you're walking away from it um feeling very positive optimistic and excited for the new week to come what's next um, on the agenda just because of how blessed you feel this week how things are just happening in your favor this week Libra and some of you um, where you've been putting in the midnight hours working your butt off um, to get something accomplished to get something achieved here you have major success by week's end. Oh my gosh. 
major success. Like this is your week, Libra. Trust your path, trust your energy, trust that things are just gonna fall into place for you and that you absolutely deserve that. And man, it's just, there's this whole network of love and support around you. So if you've been going through something really scary um, coming into this week, uh, feeling just like you're flapping in the wind, you don't know your way, you don't know the answer, you don't even maybe know what kind of help you need, this week, boom, it's like spirit sends in the troops and everything you need is coming to you to have your back, to rescue you, to help you out, to help you let go, um, overcome or move on from some challenge here, okay? So you are blessed this week in every capacity, people being there, people having your back, uh, the universe bending over backwards for you. And again, with that um, Uranus energy, it's like magic. It, it just, you're, it takes your breath away, Libra. It takes your breath away. All right, let's get into your love energies. Oh, wait, no, I'm jumping ahead of myself. Let's pull one final message for you guys for general energies. Well, you know what? You guys get two because this one jumps and then this one was coming. So here is your artwork for the first message. And it says, the crown, I am a good leader. Oh, you are going to be blessed. Major success here, Libra. And here is the artwork on the second message. And it says, build a fairy house. There is magic everywhere. Yes, that is definitely the order of the week. You feel like there is magic everywhere everywhere around you all right now let's get into your love energies for the week and see what is going on there all right so we a temporary reconciliation is coming out for some of you and that kind of just feels like a little side message so that is separate from the overall message of love that we will be receiving from spirit All right, unaligned intentions, distance and disconnection, and healing together. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. Okay, so this, some of you are in, um, you know, like committed partnerships right now, and you and your partner have been at odds. And if you are in a relationship and that's not the case, then this um, love message is not going to resonate for you. This is about um, committed couples who have just been at odds, not at the same page with each other, and it's created distance in the connection. Or um, if you're single, this is where you and another person have outrightly like separated, broke up because your intentions were not aligned with each other, okay? And there's a bit of a different message here for those of you who are single and separated opposed to those of you who are in these committed relationships and you guys have just been in the struggle, okay? Committed relationships, by week's end, you guys are working it out. You're getting back on the same page. Your intentions are coming back into alignment with each other, okay? And that's the energy in which you move forward with, especially when we look at the general messages. Um, huge improvement in committed relationships as well. Now, um, singles out there, and this may not apply to all of you, but some of you, um, there's somebody that's been heavy on your heart and you just don't know why it couldn't work out. Like, why do we have to disconnect? Um, and there's been purpose in that. And this week, I feel like you finally get a message and understanding. And that comes in with this temporary um, rec reconnection. Is some of you, I feel like you and this person are going to have a conversation this week. Um, but it's not like we're coming back together to reunite and be together this week, okay? But it's like the start of the healing process about why things went wrong between the two of you. And now for others of you, 
it's not like that card doesn't mean anything it's like you guys are finally going to talk and get it worked out and start healing together from this week moving forward okay so we'll pull cards separate on this opposed to um, this overall message so let's pull some tarot to go with the love energies Okay, a three of swords with unaligned intentions, five of wands with the distance and disconnection, and eight of swords with healing together. Oh my god, how perfect is that? Um, and let's pull two cards for temporary reconnection. But yeah, um, th whether you are committed or um, separated, you both have been hurting from whatever imbalance we had going on and there's been a lot of strife and back and forth in each of you and by week's end there's a coming together to heal to talk about things to break out of this prison of the eight of swords which is where i'm being prideful um or i'm not backing down like they've got to say sorry first like all that energy is falling away and you guys are really working it out finally and making progress, making headway on that. All right, on this temporary reconnection, seven of wands and four of pentacles. Okay, so with this, that's why it's only temporary is because one of you is not fully ready to open back up to this relationship, okay? Um, regardless of who reaches out to who, there's one of you that still needs some time to think about things, all right? But it's like this conversation needs to come in this week to help facilitate the healing process. Whether you guys are going to heal and get back together or this is the beginning of the healing so that you can finally let go. It's different for all of you, okay? And again, this is a separate message outside of this because I do see... Um, there's, you know, this energy of people really finally being able to work it out to overcome, um, you know, their disconnection with each other, the fighting, the arguing, the mixing of opinions and wants, like really overcoming that it feels much stronger for already committed relationships, that energy. But this is a general read, so that does apply to singles where somebody's trying to come in and reconnect. They really are earnest in it, okay? But um, some of you, it's like, I'm not ready, okay? Or Libra, if you're trying to reach out because the ball's in your court and they've been waiting on you, they might need some healing to do, okay? This is where somebody is like, yeah, I have feelings and I care, but I'm not going to be open. I'm not going to be vulnerable. I'm not going to, you know, spill my heart out to you. It's just like, I, I want to talk to you. I want... I want to hear your voice. I want to see where you stand. Like, this is more of where we're trying to fill each other out. And it's like there's going to be some more time that's needed for a full healing and full recovery. So let's pull three cards. One for committed couples. One for separated, um, getting back together this week. And then one for separated. And we're going to start the path of healing this week. But not so much physically reconcile back into a committed relationship with each other just yet. All right, committed couples. Yeah, we're going to finally be able to make some headway. Um, we've really just not been hearing each other. Communication has been awful. Um, you know, somebody's really not feeling heard or seen in this connection, but you guys are going to finally get beyond that. And it, maybe it's because of all this positive energy just flowing your way. All right. Um, separated, but getting back together this week, we have the Knight of Pentacles. So this has been a long time coming 
but with this energy this is positive this means that true change is being made and the foundation underneath this relationship moving forward is much more solid than it has been in the past you guys really are on the same page this time and committed not getting back together just yet yeah because look it's like more time is needed somebody is not fully decided even though we want to talk even though um, we need to have these conversations to begin the healing process it's just like one of you is not quite ready to jump all the way back in yet but it's starting okay so it might just be like hey I had a dream about you how are you doing you know or I've been thinking about you and then um, there's you guys kind of you know go your separate ways for a little bit and that's not um, because you know let's stir the pot it's like you both need that physical communication see even like um, that looks like I know that's a, um, a balloon um, in the distance but that looks like a cell phone to me like the back of a cell phone with a case on it and so and see it looks like uh, coming from her head there with the string so to me that's like we we need more than this telepathic communication like um, you guys need to have some sort of talk with each other but it's to start paving the way for the healing to take place like a lot of healing needs to happen for some of you guys okay but Libra this week is magical for you um, overall with general energies like things just finally going your way falling into place and with your romantic energies especially committed couples making major headway out of difficulties and challenges disagreements fighting arguing all of that and you guys shifting into a much more positive energy where you're on the same page and you want to heal and you know it's an equal desire it's not just one person fighting for the connection it's both of you and um, those of you that do have somebody coming back in that's like hey Libra I want to be with you and you're like hey I want to be with you you are building a new path for this relationship and you both are much more in and focused energetically those of you where it's like we can't get back together this week it's really because one of you needs more time to filter through everything all right so those are your messages libra i am sending you lots of love and light take care